yeah. because in in my opinion I, what i hate what i hate to see and i've always hated to see is when you go into a clubhouse at the end of a game is that you've got a table with the home team a table with the away team a table with the umpires and it, it comes back to I, I i firmly believe that that players have a responsibility to pick up their beer and go and sit on the umpires table and have a conversation about broadening their understanding why did something happen and why didn't it and at that point in time if it's possible and it wouldn't have been possible at the end of the canada island scenario i get it if there is emotion that surrounds a particular game that needs to be diffused but in a general scenario find a moment to have a conversation mo Furster was the best at it barry middleton was the best at it they just mm-hmm. had a relationship that was developed now, don't get me wrong they're both insanely good interstellar players who played over 300 times, both and 400 times in Barry's case for his country, they're going to be listened to. But yes. if as a player, if, I'm going to put it out there, people will criticise me for my language. As a player, don't be a dick. Nobody wants that. You just just get, just get have a conversation. Go in the bar afterwards, pick up a beer, go and understand, but understand in a conversation that you're not trying to win. If you go and sit at an umpire's table with a beer and then try and win that conversation, it's pointless. There is nothing to win at that point. 